One of the more common questions I get is why did the college decide to invest in this athletics complex? And the answer to that lies in the research. The research suggests that athletics teaches lifelong skills, it attracts a very diverse student, and builds a pride and loyalty to the college that can't be duplicated any other way. I heard a coach from a Division I university say, you know, Stu, athletics is like the front porch of your house. It's not the most important part of the house, but it's the first thing you see. And today, I am really pleased with what I see. Oh, I am so excited about all the possibilities for our students here. Being a student athlete, it's not just about the sports in general, but you're really gonna be focused on, on getting through that educational goal and, and being able to make the friendships and have the experiences that you have here through the athletics program at the same time is just a synergistic, crazy, wonderful effect. Before soccer, I came to school, went to class, just kind of went through the motions. But being a student athlete, you really learn to manage your time. Being in athletics have definitely affect me as a student by getting me to really use time management well to balance out my schoolwork and soccer. Away games and tournaments and practice on the weekends. Because as, if I can keep my grades up and still be able to do a sport that I've absolutely loved my entire life, then that's totally worth it. I find that if you've had an experience in athletics, whether it be early age, all the way through, even adulthood, that experience leads to a better, in my opinion, employee, let alone person in the society community, because to learn how to build consensus, you have to learn how to get along. You don't always have to agree, but you also learn how to respect the other person's opinion and respect their position. Well, I, I believe that athletics is just a metaphor for life. All of the struggles that athletes um, fight through on the field in terms of adversity, uh, having to persevere, overcome injuries, uh, maybe work with people that have different ways of doing things than you do are all things that students are going to encounter both in the classroom and in the workplace and so as they build those skills out on the field they can transfer them to life in general and I think be successful wherever they go. When I came on board as athletic coordinator we were trying to establish athletics without any on-campus facilities and now we're going to have a comprehensive athletic program that's going to have state-of-the-art facilities better than anything within not just the district, but probably Northern California. Well, the thing that I love is now when you come on campus, it's the first thing that you see when you drive in. These amazing fields that really are state-of-the-art, nobody else has anything that even comes close to what we have right now. There are still yet to come nine tennis courts, a cross-country track, and an interpretive trail. So we're hoping that those will be complete next spring. And then the new gymnasium, we expect that to open for the fall 2015 semester. Uh, the design is awesome. The layout is perfect. The lighting, the fields themselves, the facilities are, are top notch. <laughs> the win streak was, I mean, it was pretty great. No one really expected us to do very well because of the fact that we were a first year program, but being able to prove to them that we can win and we can continuously win, that was definitely a blessing and one of the coolest experiences. Coming from high schools to not having a program to all of a sudden, three months ago, Folsom Lake College had their first women's soccer game and three months later, they were still undefeated, 19 wins. It was exciting for us because we were able to make history and you know, set the record for future teams to come. I think that people realize with this, there's a there's a hunger for that here. The campus was excited, the students, the faculty, everybody was was in tune to what was going on and asking, always asking, when do we play next? When do, who do we play? And so it was obvious to me that that there was a there was definitely a hunger for that kind of thing, and it filled a void. It filled a void that we haven't something that we haven't had here at Folsom Lake yet. The great things about this uh, athletics facility is it really is a community resource to be used by all of the residents of the area. And people should feel good about that and should participate in it and contribute to it. Um, they, you know, there's lots of opportunities for people to get involved and support something that's also gonna support them. 
people who are interested should contact the advancement office here at the college. Um, there's lots of ways that they can put their name on something where they can sponsor and really help these facilities grow and flourish and help themselves as well. It's going to be so exciting to meet all of these um, inspiring young athletes that are coming our way and I can't wait to see them on the field. I'll be out there cheering for them.